apparently a bunch of people would like to pay us ransom for a bunch of people. So 53, 53, 53. Uh, it looks like it's not just a bunch of people, it's actually just one, and <laughs> it's all the same one. Okay, right. So, what are we even up to? What are we doing? Is there anything we can do? Let's check more prisoners to ransom, because we like... Oh! We like money. A hundred gold. We like a hundred gold, that's... That's pretty much almost double of what we have, so we'll take that. Let's just take all those little bits and bobs here as well. Can you usurp the kingdom of Borgu? Except we cannot. Not yet, anyway. So, did we not... Yeah, she has claims on this stuff. Um... What is that stuff? What do you have a claim on? What is this? Where is this? Over here. Ah, that's already in my realm, it appears. But we could potentially press her claim for a whole amount of money. Uh, no, not money, but prestige. So subjugation would probably be the best thing here. But we do not have the prestige to do it. What do you belong to? You belong to the four. Ah, oh, let's create the four. Let's create this and we give it to the member of our family. Our dear mother, whom we are the heir to anyway. And I will grant you... This vassal, there you go, my dearest mama, can we arrange a marriage for you? I doubt it. Another son, another alliance. Let's see, no one with a good trait really. Let's go with that. Let's get that duchy here. Allied with us. Sounds good to me. We like internal alliances. In this game it's much more interesting than in Crusader Kings 2. Not that it didn't matter before, but now it's just much more interesting. So let's check what we can do. Could take the whole duchy here. Could subject now we can't. We don't have the money. We could conquer. Holy war is a bit cheaper, but we have very little piety to speak of. Can't declare war here. Let's see, that's mainly desert, though. Conquering... Two or three duchies. I mean... We can't afford, like, two duchies. But we probably should go over here, then. However... That's a little bit... Yeah, that's just not ideal. What can we do here? Also a big duchy. Just break in here. Kinda. That's a... Tiny duchy. Should we break in here? Claims do you have? Subjugation would be fun. I mean, maybe we should wait for a good subjugation. 1350 is not a whole lot. And we could get to it. 
1,250. Can we go on a hunt to put us ahead a bit? Not yet. Could hold the feast though. Costs us a whole lot. My god. Currently money is still somewhat of an issue for us. Maybe we should go raid again. Question is of course... Wait. What faction? None that matters. The important people are all already primed to be good boys and girls. Uh, why are we having only sons here? Not, I mean, I don't mind too much, but it is suspicious. I chiefdom of Carnum. Let's do it. Can I subjugate you? Oh, that would be better. Yeah. I think subjugation will go against the Yenna. Yeah, definitely. That would be the biggest chunk we can take next to Borgu. That would be a good subjugation for us there. In our favor. Though we need to remember to remain careful and vigilant, else there will be another... Another empire created. We definitely don't want that. Let's get someone good in there. Let's reassign her. And our mother, I mean, she's not really useful for anything, but... It is what it is. So, 1,250 prestige, we are close, we are getting there. Could go on pilgrimage. That only gives us piety though. Yes, totally. Anyone else we can ransom? My, my. 10, 10, 10, 10. Fine. I don't think we need to sway this man anymore. Let's check our factions. No one's really mad here. What is du jour yours? Your Buland. Okay, so you basically have to fight all the other kingdoms there. Not really our job. Likeable, direct vassal opinion. Yes, plus 10, that's good. Making our life a little bit easier. Especially once we come take Yene. Oh, I'm looking forward to that one. They're strong. Don't underestimate them. All these are full up. Uh, excuse me, what did I inherit now? Stuff over here. Is that the Kingdom of Nubia that we inherited? It seems to be the way. So. You get this and that. You get that. You get this. And you get the Kingdom of Nubia. Enjoy, sunny boy. Ah, a daughter. You will be my Chancellor. And I definitely need prestige. Okay. Can't negotiate an alliance with him. <laughs> okay. That's fine. Let's get you a matrilineal match. And... None of these are real great. Hmm. 
Let's go with this kid. Not super ideal, not terrible. Can you stop losing against this dude here? Didn't you have all this before? A call to war. Join a peasant uprising as a defender. Where? Where needest you are troops? Where are they? Now that's some other... What? Over there. Mm-hmm. Okay. That will be a little bit... Oh, no. It's not ideal. Let's just get our main troops. Those should be just fine. Uh, these I would need to recruit. Don't care for it. How did we get into a, a pathetic alliance like that? Sometimes I do wonder. Prisoners to ransom, 10, 10, 10. Doesn't really matter to me then which one you take. Kingdom of Borgu, no thanks. Just a bunch of duchies we can create. Realm will lose land if a vassal dies. Hmm. Okay. So we'll just have to take that land then. My troops should be fine dealing with this. It just takes forever to walk over there. So I'm building a very tube-like empire that appears We're trying to prevent having too many good empires too many potential empires anyway I wonder will the golden horde be a true threat to the world this time around Bulgaria is doing well, interestingly enough. It's not often you see that. Oh, look at that. Fighting in bad terrain, shame. And our war contribution is 0%, uh, of course. Always with the lies. Uh, but... We can now subjugate, and I think we will still go for these fools. They are weaker, yes, so uh, it, it is clear to us that they lost something there. Or can we subjugate Borgu? No. Still in its shoes. I mean, these look big, but they aren't. Look at that. 1,600 and nothing. Ghana, 90 soldiers. My god, the kingdom of Ghana, a true powerhouse. So these will be what we subjugate in our lifetime. So let us declare war. It will be a difficult war. Do not mistake this situation for less than what it is. As the enemy marches upon us. We prepare to send our most valiant troops. Let's get the logistician. Because we want the supplies. Okay. I think we're done with raising our troops. Let's move and engage the enemy. Oh, he was caught out by someone. 
Meaning we might have a chance to actually attack him. Let's see. Let's get our better commander in here. Will we... Alright, I think we got the right choice, but they have a really, really good commander here. Lots of positive commandy, commandery traits. We're losing some money. As is tradition during war. Alright, let's go straight for the capital. I think that is where they do retreat to as well. Our troops are beaten as well a little bit. So let's see some details. How many troops did we lose? Less than him. Which is uh, very positive. Definitely want to lose less than the enemy when you attack them. Ah. Oh. Okay. Someone is very angry with us and we're like, no skin of my back. That relaxes me that you are angry with us. So here, let's raise some more troops there. Let's see, he will appear eventually, I'm sure. We'll bring his armies to bear. And we need to make sure that we do not lose out to attrition. All right. Okay, so we have some uh, some peasants uprising. So I will I will get some uh, mercenaries involved to deal with the peasants. And what shall it be? Some bowmen. Two bands of bowmen. Or one band of pike and these. Let's get them. Let's just get them. They will deal with it. And they can then support us as well. Will be a better investment than just a few bowmen. Let us have another friend. Sure. Why not? Given the choice, we want friends. Let's hope we get some really, really good hostage here. Come on now, game. That was that battle. Now let's take them to the next. Yes! We got him personally. Very good. Very good indeed. So we stand these down and our mercenaries will take care of these rebels. Very good. Look at that. He hates us. Let's make it even worse. Come on, convert boy. Nope. <laughs> he doesn't see it. Does not see the point. Okay, that was another battle won. Let's go get these fools. Maybe they will. Before we even arrive. I was very fortunate. Oh look. Bori has become Gur. Meaning we can fight them again. Because they have a different head of state. I'll stand these down, as we have won this little rebellion. 
it's all, all going decent, decent, decent. Yes, I will ransom your prisoner. Let's sway this man to us. Come on, let's be friends, huh? You don't want our vassalage. Okay, fine. Nope, we still have a truce with them. They just broke apart due to succession, I would assume. And we lost a bunch of stuff up here. I've uh, probably also through succession. So let's see. What can we do? Claims. Holy war for a duchy, huh? Can't we get something bigger? Something better? Holy war for a kingdom. We are not a paragon of virtue yet. And we're quite far away from that. And we cannot invade a kingdom yet because we're not exalted among men, but we will be soon. So with subjug subjugation, with invading a kingdom, that's basically how we grow the fastest. Speaking of growing the fastest, let's uh, send some prisoners through conversion out into the world. Uh, you don't want to? Fine, okay, then stay in prison. There's no one here we really need to have, so just sending them out, converting them into the world is pretty much good for us. Just become boring. And also renounce your claims, huh? How about that now? Uh, I think he already is doing stuff. Come on. Everyone out there. Go spread the bori. The bori word. Ah. Our concubine is pregnant once more. Sure. Are you just one county? Yes, let's take them. They are just one. One little county. And with our Mercenaries, that will be no trouble at all. Dun. This is way too epic in terms of music for what's currently happening. So this dude obviously is dangerous to us because he is very strong but we will sway him making him like us and eventually once our next child is born we will marry get an alliance going. And when we do, all shall be well. Ah, see? Already he likes us better. For helping him with his books. Our siege is done. So this is... Te wait, where was it? Oh no. I already forgot where we were. Ah, where? Let's see. That's where it was. Okay. You. Okay, let's create this. You can have that. And you can have that. 
sound great. Sound absolutely fantastic. Two hundred and fifty, that's a lot. It's a lot for what it is. It's so little. Mm. Can we do with you? Pressing someone's claims is very expensive. Very expensive indeed. Council opinion plus 20. Yes, hello. That's a good one. Uh, we must be the father. Surely we don't, we don't care. Let's check our council. What do we got? This guy could use replacing. Are you good at anything? Ah, come on. Let's put him in. He's not ideal, but he's better. Okay. Our son is no longer sickly. And... We want a marriage, but you don't have anyone to marriage to, to create an alliance. Whoops, too many escape presses. Oh no. One of our children died. And it invalidated an alliance inside, which doesn't matter too much. And another one gains the trade sickly. Oh no. Let's see who hates us. Nothing to be done about it. We have a duchy claim there. Doesn't really help us. Because they're all very costly. I think we should go holy war this one. So holy were this one, we shall. How many troops do you have? Good. Ah, the kingdom of Borgu can be created now. As well we shall. There you go. Uh, yeah. Our glory is widely known, so we are now exalted among men, meaning we can invade a kingdom. So we shall make sure to create all those kingdoms around us. Uh, which is where? Anibia? Don't know where that is. Anbia, where is that? Up there. Okay. There we go. I still think I should probably move my capital at some point to somewhere. Okay, 58%. That's 
pretty good. Our enemy is being beaten up in a different war. Alright, unfortunate for him. We don't really mind. Okay, what is this? Wealth of plenty. My treasury is brimming with gold and silver and all expenses are cared for as wealthy lord I am expected to have patronage of some kind of artist. So we could have immaculate gardens. Ooh, plus one prestige. Hmm. Clergy opinion. Development growth. Uh, let's go for immacul immaculate gardens. We need all the prestige we can get. He keeps being swayed, like the fool he is. Our concubines hate us, well... I read this as she gained the title pregnant, but it is just a trait. So she is now traitfully pregnant. Let's see what the succession will do to our holdings. Titles lost on succession. Why do I even hold this? Oh, yeah, okay. I can hold two. It's fine. And some lower rank titles there. That's fine. Oh, look! The enemy! They have reappeared! Don't think we will get very far here. I like this one, Administrator is fun. We're also looking at a new patch very soon, or maybe by the time this is released the new patch is out and we're still playing on the old patch because that's how I do things. I play, I record. So let us give out some titles, shall we? You get this. And you get that. And you get a spouse. And we want the H. The Kingdom of Gur. No, that's not ours yet. Uh, let's go by... What are you? You're a girl. Matrilineal. So let's get you just someone with a good trait. Doesn't really matter. Wow, there is no one with a good trait. Except for very, very old dudes. Come on, there must be someone with a good trait. Yeah, let's go with this dude. Don't care for the alliance, but that's fine. So you belong to the duchy of this thing, which we will now create. And also give to you. And you. The Kingdom of Gur. Don't think there are any direct vassals here. Uh, doesn't really look like it. You can do whatever you want. All right. Um, let's check what we need to become feudal. Absolute has all tribal era innovations, which we definitely do not have yet. So I feel like we might want to wait a little longer until we have all these done before we adapt absolute tribal authority because that is gonna make our life a little bit harder for a while. But becoming feudal will be a good thing for us. Eventually. Eventually. So, invade a kingdom, 2000 prestige. We, we, we will get there. Uh, we're not gonna invade this kingdom though. I think we might actually go invade over here because these are more complete kingdoms. 
Like the Kingdom of Egypt, probably. The Sultanate of Egypt. Yeah, that would be neat. That would be real neat. We're stretching ourselves a little bit. But that's okay. That's okay. I don't mind. Who are you fighting? I hope it's my vassals and I hope you're losing to my vassals. Yes. Very good, you're losing to my vassals. Kisha. Another son. For the men of the many sons. You. The kingdom of Sahara. No, I don't care. Let's check. Who hates us? Who needs a... Marriage. Wait, are you a daughter? Your daughter. Is that not her? Hmm. Well, no alliance to be had here. Our mercenary contract is expiring. Perfectly fine by me. What titles can we create? Let's make sure we create all the good titles here. That's how we get all the prestige. Wait, so a kingdom gives us 200 prestige for 250. These give us 300 prestige for 125. What am I doing? Why am I not creating all these duchy titles? That's much more efficient. Okay, let's do that. And this is mine. You get this, you get it, yeah, yeah, no, yeah. what you get? Why can't I give you this? This is my own domain. How is that not? Am I what? This is mine, grant two. And I would like... Where are my children? <laughs> there. Why? Why can't I give this to him? Oh, because it says only recent titles. That's why. So you get this, my boy. And you get the High Chief on top of it. Do you have more kids to take care of? I mean, our heir, but that doesn't matter. Let's give him this too. Doesn't matter? Not really. So we're not gonna do it. Uh, right. Yes! My plan is to build more duchies. More duchies is what the land needs. Ooh. Ooh. Yes. Wait, wait, wait. All of these are good. So we can mint new coinage. We can debase the coinage. So everyone might fi find it out, losing us some prestige, but we have a higher chance of getting it, so we get money and development growth and some experience, which I like. So let's go with this. Nope, everyone learns how cheap the coins are. So that wasn't good. 32%. Oh, uh, well. Can't be helped. How many troops you got? Two. Like you have literally two soldiers. Are you joking? Why is it still so expensive to jack you? Are you kidding me? Oh, he has all those claims. Why aren't you pushing your own claims, my friend? You should be pushing your own claims there. Can't wait for me to do it. Gur got a little bit here. 
Kur is somewhat of a thorn in my side. We have inherited the kingdom of the Fur, meaning our mother just died. So who do we got here? Her. You get the kingdom of the Fur. You are of my kin. Do you belong to kingdom of the Fur? Grant this vassal there. Enjoy. This dude it really is your vassal. So all is well. Yeah. It's looking fine. How many titles do we have? Always make sure you don't have too many titles because we have too many titles. West to four. You may have the High Chiefdom of West of Four. I don't want it. There you go. Now you love us. Look at you loving us. You can't help it. Alright. New perk available. Large levies. So we get more troops. Potentially, anyway. Empty council position. Ah, you're not even all that bad there. So, what do we want? Increase development, building construction time. Yeah, let's just go with extra taxes. I'll take the money. And we will create some more. Okay, so, Kaga. Who lives in Kaga? Anyone of my line in Kaga? can have this there you go let's see the Duchy of Dafur let us create this wait a minute is this all mine yeah I don't want that uh children you you get all that <laughs> <laughs> you get the high chief no of the four and can I grant you the kid as a vassal I don't know potentially the game should tell me grant vassals to rightful leech yeah let's grant some vassals to some rightful leeches there and we are in some kind of war somewhere. And why exactly? Oh, we inherited this war. Okay. 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 Um, right. I, I didn't even notice that. So let's move our troops. And actually raise some. And we'll leave it here for now. We will meet back together next time around. Thanks for watching. See you then. Bye bye.